This is The Huddle, presented by the Midwest Christian Boys Football Camp, otherwise known as Man Camp. Welcome to The Huddle. Hey friends, I'm Mike McCurry, and you have joined us in The Huddle. We are concluding the last broadcast of the first week of this brand new program. I greatly appreciate your investment of time this far. I'm joined today by Pastor Dan Woodward, a pastor of the First Baptist Church in Dwight, Illinois, and evangelist Tim Booth. These men together make up the founding team of football camp, the Midwest Christian Boys Football Camp, otherwise known as Man Camp. We're talking today about our theme for 2023, which just happens to be the 30th year of football camp. Gentlemen, Talk to us about why we've chosen Finish Strong as our theme this year. Pastor Woodward, let's start with you. Well, Finish Strong, of course, Tim and I are, there's more sand on the bottom of the hourglass than there is on the top. And we want to personally finish strong. But in us finishing strong, we need another generation to look far enough to head, say, I'm going to finish strong. We've watched Brother Woodward and Brother Booth finish strong. I want to finish strong. And uh, that, that, that's what we need is people in their place, young men in their place year in and year out, not up one minute, not down and down the next minute, but uh, just their eye on the goal to finish strong. Amen. Brother Booth, what does finish strong mean to you? Yeah, you know, um, and Brother Woodward, uh, certainly we've talked many times and no church can be effective without men that are faithful. And it's a, it's sad that so many men are bailing on their pastors and churches. You know, some little thing gets burned in their saddle, or wife gets upset about something, and off they go. Uh, and they have no biblical reason whatsoever. And we, we have to have another generation of young men that have some convictions that'll, that'll fight the battle till the battle is over. And that's not gonna be over till we see Jesus. So we've Amen. got to have a generation to finish strong. Amen. And you gentlemen have been around long enough to know that many ministries flounder. They fail in the generational transitions. And you guys didn't start football camp. You had, you had no idea that it would last as long and be as successful as it has when, when it was started. But now where we sit right now, you're not planning on, on shutting the doors after the 30th year. To God be the glory, we plan to continue going. And as a look at the ministry, I get to, re to direct like Bible Tracks Incorporated. We've survived, we've survived 20, 30 years after the founder has passed. But to God be the glory, football camp, your desire is that it continues, right, Pastor? Yes, sir. We, we, well, we put some young men in place already, been working with them. I think this might be the fourth or fifth year that we've been working with the young leadership. We're not uh, Tim and I are not stepping aside anytime soon. We will as as the Lord leads us, but we we put some young men in that have taken this thing to another level. Football camp has grown bigger than Tim. We always thought it was bigger than we were anyways. <laughs> right. But now it's become bigger than we can handle. The calf has grown so big we can't pick it up no more. Amen. <laughs> well, Brother Booth, in the last 20, 30 seconds or so, tell pastors, youth pastors, parents, why they should send their young men to this camp to be taught how to finish strong? Well, be surrounded. These young men are going to be surrounded with men of God who there's some younger men of God. And there's a number of older men of God that have uh, proven themselves to have convictions and be faithful and steadfast through the years. And they're hands on all day with these young men. It's not about football. It's a little bit about football a whole lot about getting a generation to serve God. We desperately need young men under that influence. Amen. Gentlemen, thank you so much. You're going to have to join us next week. I'm excited about the slate of guests. You will see Pastor Woodward. You will see Brother Booth next week on the program. But join us next week in The Huddle. Thank you for listening to The Huddle. You can find more information and register for Man Camp online at mancamp1994.org. Man Camp is a ministry of the First Baptist Church in Dwight, Illinois. Join us next time in the huddle.